welcome to another video today. My name is Chris, uh, and in this video today, we're once again taking a look at the Rockaway Town Square Shopping Center or Mall in Rockaway, Dover, New Jersey. Now, the reason why we're taking a look at this mall today is because we just got an article uh, just a little bit over an hour ago from the NorthJersey.com. So, without a further ado, uh, we're going to now read the article, and we're going to um, figure out when the final day of operation for Sears and Roebuck at the mall will be, and uh, we'll let, let's see what the article has. So, without a further ado, here we go. Sears to, to ex Sears and Roebuck to exit Rockaway Town Square Mall on Sunday, September thirteenth, two thousand and twenty. Morris County's largest shopping destination is losing one of its original anchor stores. Following multiple bankruptcies, reorganizations, and waves of store closures, temporary job postings by Sears have indicated another round of store closures, including the retailer's location at the Rockaway Town Square Mall in Rockaway, Dover, New Jersey. Sears did not immediately respond to a call for comment. Mall owner Simon Property declined to comment about the individual vendors. And this is obviously uh, what we went over yesterday about Raymore and Flanagan leasing. So Raymore and Flanagan on the lower level of the soon-to-be former Sears and Roebuck store at least about 38,000 square feet of retail space. No sign indications a store closure or going out of business sale were visible on Tuesday at the Rockaway Town Square location, and the store was conducting regular business, including its auto center. Employees of the store said that they learned of the closure a week or two ago and were advised that the store would close on, once again, Sunday, September 13, 2020. Job postings Monday advertised temporary jobs related to the store closures, including hardware and home appliance sales, backroom staff, and cashiers. Sears is one of the four original anchors to the mall, which opened in 1977. J.C. Penney, Lord & Taylor, and Bambergers, rebranded as Macy's in 1986, remain. Struggling, J.C. Penney announced this month a bankruptcy-related permanent closure of 242 locations. Obviously, none of them were in New Jersey, but Long Island did get hit. Obviously, if you guys want to go check out that video after this, you can go right ahead. But yes, none of the J.C. Penney store closures were in New Jersey. Sears previously cut back its space, subleasing about 38,000 square feet of retail space on the first floor to furniture retailer Raymore & Flanagan in the year of 2016. The closure will now leave only two, count them, two Sears & Roebuck stores within the state of New Jersey, including the one in downtown Hackensack, New Jersey, and at the Newport Center Mall in Jersey City, New Jersey. Sears appliance centers in New Jersey, including the Newton and West Orange locations, have been rebranded as American Freight, which pretty much means Sears appliances and Sears outlets have now been all rebranded to American Freight uh, because Sears, uh, I guess, sold that off and all that kind of stuff happened. So, unfortunately, there is nothing else here. Um, but the writer responsible for this article article was uh, William. Uh, Westhoven, I hope I pronounced your name right. This was in the Morris, Morristown Daily Record. This probably ended up in the Bergen Record, too. Um, but, yes, I wanted to read you guys this article very quickly. Um, but, yes, so Sears will be getting, I believe Sears and Roebuck at Rockaway will be beginning their liquidation sales, I believe, on Thursday, uh, July 3rd, 2020. And the conclusion of the liquidation sales will occur on Sunday, September 13th. 2020. So, yes, this is very sad. So, rest in peace to the store and especially the elevators and the escalators on uh, 1977 to uh, 2020. Um, I would say that that store at the mall in particular had about a. Hold on, I'm just doing a little bit of calculator work here. A 43 year run at the mall. So, after 43 years, Sears and Roebuck is closing at the Rockaway Town Square Mall. All right, so guys, that's about going to do it for this video, this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And like I said, I am going to include the link to the original video of how I found out the information. And now the media is finally putting out uh, articles about it. And also a link to the article I just showed you guys. So those, both of those links will be located in the description below. Anyways, guys, thank you again for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed this video. And that will be it.